let's do potato physics. Take a large potato, and I will insert it on the tip of this kitchen knife. Look, it barely holds. Now, what will happen if I hit this handle? I will hit it with my mallet. I will do something like this. The potato will fall, right? Let's check. Are you ready? <laughs> the potato is actually going up. What's happening? This potato is large. It's inertial. It doesn't have time to move every time when I hit this handle. So the knife goes through the potato. Now, when you decide to remove this potato from, the, uh, from this knife, never touch this knife with your finger. Do this. Watch me. Done. Next demonstration with potato. Everyone knows that if you take a, 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 a straw, plastic straw, it's not sturdy enough to pierce the potato, right? But now I will use physics. I will cover this uh, top of this straw with my finger when I pierce this potato, which means I will trap air inside this straw. And this trapped air will make this straw stronger. Let's check. You can make a porcupine, a hedgehog. Oh, doesn't work. It always works. Physics always works. You can create any creature that you want. Do it at home. It's a lot of fun. Look, potato physics.